Hello, my lovely students of Shakespeare, and welcome to Macbeth. I'm Miss Optig, and today I'm going to take you through Act 5, Scene 1 of this tragic play. Lady Macbeth's lady-in-waiting is talking to Lady Macbeth's doctor. They are both worried about her. I have been watching her for two nights now, and I have not seen any of what you have described. Maybe we should just wait a little longer. She is doing some really weird things. I saw her one night. She wrote a letter, and then she folded it up several times and threw it in the fire. Maybe we should wait then, just to see if anything happens. Lady Macbeth sleepwalks into the room. Do you see that? Her eyes are open, but she appears to be completely asleep. And why is she washing her hands? I have seen her do that before. Almost every time she sleepwalks, she rubs her hands together like this. It's almost like she's trying to wash something off them. How interesting. Out, damn spot, out, I say. Are you a soldier or afraid? What kind of man are you? But who would have thought that the old man would have had so much blood in him? <laughs> the Lord of Fife had a wife. But where is she now? You must stop, my lord. You'll ruin everything that we've worked for. We should leave. I don't think that we were meant to hear any of this. I hear this every night and never know what she means. What is happening to her is not something that I can fix. Her head needs help, not her body. Quick, take her to bed before we hear any more. The lady-in-waiting takes Lady Macbeth back to bed. This scene is really important because it is showing us the mental toll that all of this has taken on Lady Macbeth. She has become so overwhelmed with grief and guilt over her part in Duncan's death and all of the events that have happened since that she is now sleepwalking and spilling all of their secrets to anyone who is in the room. This is not good for a number of reasons, but the main one is that anyone could walk in and realise that she was responsible for the murder of Duncan. Given that she is the Queen now, that is not something that she would want to happen. But her guilt is literally driving her crazy, and it is not going to end well. But let's check in on how the war's going in Act 5, Scene 2.